But I was wondering though, Gail, I know that Glenda does this all the time. Are you Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. <laughs> People, this is my sister, Gail. Hi. So <laughs> Glenda's not here, but I think Gail can handle this. I think you know what I'm asking, right? Am Do I, I supposed to say like? And what else? <laughs> you can do oh, it. Subscribe. Yes. And ring a bell. <laughs> yes, ring the bell. Ring the bell. <laughs> what else? Jacqueline. Write I'm a honest. comment. Oh, write a comment. And share. And share because we'd love to hear from you. Yes. From the Lemster. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, you got to forgive her. She's got it. She's got it. You know what you need to do, right? All right. Thank you, Gail. Bye. Well, Terry is here, and we're hoping that we can find a couple pumpkins for her. We'll see. Makaya is going to be our uh, strong man. Pumpkin guide. The pumpkin man. Let's see what we can do. I know, Terry, there's a few over here. There's big ones that uh, I don't know what sizes you're looking for or whatever. But um, some of them are still green, but we've learned that they will continue to ripen. So there's large ones. There's a pretty orange one there, but they're big. There's more. You can look around. Look at them all. Um, these, these are really small. That's okay. Oh, you want the clippers? Oh, yes. Okay, clippers. There's um, medium sized ones over there. They're like soccer ball size. Oh, I'm missing all the action here. There's a little one. Do you want another little one, or do you want me to find a little bit bigger one? Um, if I can have that other little one there, yeah. and then if there's a good get... size one, orangey one, right, right there. It's a bigger one. I mean, you pick whatever you want. I'm just trying to show you there's the orangey a, ones. Yeah. There's some bigger ones. They're soccer ball size. I don't, over there. I don't want real two. I don't want Ooh, real big. That's all right. They're just gonna sit on my steps. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, I wonder why they're <laughs> a lot of them are still green. They'll turn because, honey, we put them in the ground the seeds later than um, most people probably put them in a week or two before us. Doesn't the frost also take a part in it? You're right. Like, I don't, I think the frost kills the leaves and um, let the sun get in there. Yeah, let's the sun get in more. But I guess once they start to turn orange, they can turn orange all on their own. Eve off the vine. Yeah, Is that a good perfect. one? Perfect. Yay. Okay, okay. All right, so this was our first and harvesting of pumpkins. That one right yeah, there. this one right there, baby. That big one. Okay. Thank you, honey. Here, do you want what do you want me? To, oh, I was like, I can't carry the pumpkin. No, do you want I'll to put it in the you. cart? Since we brought the garden cart, yeah. you could actually some of those. We so we planted two different varieties. So this variety is different than what all, uh, all the others. So she said she wanted this one, babe. I think. Is it this one? Yeah. Yeah, that it's one looks good. Yeah. We have um, cooked like a shepherd's pie inside a pumpkin. Oh, a pumpkin yum! Pumpkin. Ooh. Yeah. I think we. I think we baked it a little bit first, just to soften it up, and then put the hamburg and the potato. And that, sounds that sounds delicious. Yeah. yeah, it's really good. Haven't done that in a long time. All right, well, here's the first pumpkins. I wonder how you would avoid this. You gotta turn them. Turn them. Yeah. You gotta turn them. By... Yep. Oh. Next year. No thanks. <laughs> Next year. There they are. Put them in the ground and leave them. <laughs> yeah, it Thank is a lot of work. You. You're welcome. Thank you very much. So it seems like we're going on a trip. Just a little trip to the backyard. See all that hay? It's got to go out around the beehives. So we are moving it. I should say we. Yeah, I'm in the car watching. But Micah is going to go down here and he's going to move the um, hay around the beehives so that it will keep the northerly, northerly winter wind off the hives for the winter. So here we are.
I already have some of the bales behind them. I just want to make sure that there's enough coverage to cut the wind. I mean, it's really windy. We're in a higher elevation up here. Um, I think there are other people nearby that keep bees, so it is possible, but I want to give them every chance to make it through to the survive. winter. So I'm going to put the hay in. I'm going to put um, insulation in the top covers, and I'm going to um, talk to my friend Tyler about uh, wrapping them with something. I, I have Tyvek that could keep the wind off them, but I want to see what he uses and give him the best chance I can. I already have some of the bales behind them. I just want to make sure that there's enough coverage to cut the wind. I mean, it's really windy. We're in a higher elevation up here. Um, I think there are other people nearby that keep bees, so it is possible, but I want to give them every chance to make it to survive. the winter. So I'm going to put the hay in. I'm going to put um, insulation in the top covers, and I'm going to um, talk to my friend Tyler about uh, wrapping them with something. I, I have Tyvek that could keep the wind off them, but I want to see what he uses and give him the best chance I can. Looks like a beautiful day though, doesn't it? Sky's blue. It's a bit chilly though. I've been stung about seven times this summer. And, uh, I don't know, I guess. Well, I think you've been stung seven times because you don't use the smoker. You come in here when any time of the day. You don't like follow the bees rules. You gotta follow the bee rules. You don't. You follow your own rules and you get stung. That's kind of how it works. Because I, um, I think it's because several times I've come in here and the bees are really docile and it seems like no big deal to be around them. But other times, especially um, as it became, came later and uh, er, well, early this fall, um, I think they get protective of the honey and I was in here. Actually, one time I was standing outside the fence, just watching them, and one whabbed to me right here. Oh, you and, play with uh, the bees, you're gonna get stung. It's true. I don't know if that really makes a difference. Are you trying to give them more room? Done? Yeah. You you brought up a good point. What was that point? Well, about the snow building up and then collapsing on the back. But um, I'll keep a close eye on them. Like any time it snows, I usually have to shovel the roof off. I'll come down here and make sure these are cleaned off and in good shape. Okay. All right, bees. It's time for them to oh. go to sleep. What? What's a huh? What's a huh, That's babe? A good point you made. I know. I never even thought of that. Maybe I'll just back them up. That's what I mean. Bit. Like they're not supposed to necessarily be on them, but more or less just be something that breaks the wind. Yeah. And you saw that Micah bought me those urns a while back, right? No. Those are um really nice heavy duty oh, I, cast, yeah. iron. Yeah. Ooh, cast iron yeah i've been wanting those kind for years and yeah. finally as a gift when we came here he bought them for me yeah they look good so yeah let's put the pumpkins on my front porch all right so the big ones are yours you want them over by the um door or do you want them by the here now if you put them by here somebody might go oh nice pumpkins well i don't have a big sign out saying anything like free right. come get pumpkins Where but maybe want? by the door <laughs> Keeps getting me. I, I can't laugh. It hurts my stomach. The stems are prickly. Yeah, the girls laugh at me every time I get hurt too. <laughs> we don't laugh. Wait, Joe. I didn't want them on either side. Huh? I, I wanted them together. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Maybe. Yeah, like move one so that they look a little nice, and then we could probably put a littler one in front of it or something. That works. You'll have to go get a little one. I'll do that. No, they're all right there. Oh. 
That's all right. You don't have to do it, Joe. Unless you want to do it. I mean, oh, I can here. pick up a little pumpkin. You want the tiny one or the medium one? Mm -hmm. Um, maybe or maybe both. a tiny one and a, and a medium one. All right, why don't we do that? And then we'll put the other two by that. I invited my brother here to decorate my house. Well, no. <laughs> it just so happened. Yeah, it was for other reasons <laughs> that we're not going to talk about on the video. Uh, perfect. Good job. Thank you. Yeah. And then he earned some pumpkins. Is that what I did? Yeah. All this free labor, I get the pumpkins. You do. All right, I'm going to take a picture Ow. of you. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> the prickery pumpkins. All right. well, one. one thing that we learned about um, pumpkins when you pick them fresh from the patch is that they are prickly. Uh, yeah. When you touch the stem? Yeah, they're like little, ow, it's actually in the finger. <laughs> you have to rub rub the prickers off if you pick them fresh. Yeah. Well, I guess now we know. Yeah. Ow. Okay. You wouldn't think pumpkins <laughs> would be so dangerous. But look how pretty these pumpkins are. Right from our pumpkin patch. Right from Micah's pumpkin patch. Yeah. And as we've learned, the green will turn orange. Just take a little bit of time. I don't know how much These time. These are going to be rolling around in the back as I'm driving. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, right. I got to stop laughing. It hurts my stomach. Yeah, well, stop All right. laughing. All right, I'll just uh, end here now. We'll do that. So here we are. It's another Saturday. It's another pile of wood. It's another wood stacking party. But this time, it's just Micaiah and... And Tyler. Tyler. Hey, Tyler. Okay. Thanks for helping, Micaiah. So... This is a uh, two cord here, honey? Yeah, two cord. So we're gonna try to stack at least a cord in this area, which will feed our uh, wood stove that's in the living room area. The rest of the wood will be for the furnace in the basement, but I think they're looking to stack at least one cord today before we go apple picking. So I'll let you guys do it. Bye. Are you guys on break or something? Yeah, because I still see lots of wood. I'm just like, <laughs> I, I don't know what's going on, but we're taking our time, enjoying the day, and all right, smell of the fresh air. And pretty soon you'll smell the burgers because I will. I'll start making the burgers. One now. and a half times faster if you join us. Really? Yeah, <laughs> Gee, thanks. Our pumpkin patch is pretty popular. We've had a few other people come out, but uh, today Clarabelle's gonna pick out a pumpkin. Right, Clarabelle. Right there. <laughs> you like that one? Look at this. That's a big one, huh? This one. You want that one? No. <laughs> she just want to choose the first one. I don't blame her. Yeah. Okay. Well, you pick one. You want to get down. Careful. I'm trying to see where all the orange ones are. Too, I know. They're actually ready, I think. Let's see. It looks like it looks like there's a couple here. What about? You like that one? What, baby? Mm -hmm. That hurt. That's okay. Yeah, it's this one that Kaya found. Look at that one. Look at how nice that is. Ooh, that seems like almost perfect. It's all orange, you know, you want and it, and it looks like Clarabelle size. Clara, look at, do you want to take that one home and make a face? Let me help you cut it. Yeah, go help tie it. Yeah. You want to cut it? Just squeeze that together. Squeeze them. Yeah, pull, the, pull them together just like this. Just like that. Pull them. Wow, good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Look at this. A little prickly. If you take all those little yeah. prickers off, yeah. Whoa! What do you think? Beautiful. Pretty nice. This is a perfect pumpkin. <laughs> Want to try to hold it? Oh. Oh. <laughs> but maybe you can carve it. You can cut a hole right here and make a face on it. That perfect. is a perfect pumpkin. Could you say thank you? Good job. <laughs> <laughs>